What's going on, Matt, with the Handy Manual? This is a continuation video on my last video where I cleaned out my old van and I just purchased a new van. It's a Ford Transit 350 and uh, I wanted to give you guys a walkthrough. I literally just picked it up, so uh, it's still pretty dirty. The previous owner was a mechanic, so there's a bunch of nuts and bolts. And right now I'm just kind of figuring out what I want to do with it, how I want to set up my tools. But as you can see, it's a high roof. Let me show you what it looks like inside. So it came with a bunch of shelving and mechanics drawers, uh, which are really nice. And it's got this nice worktop. It's got a light over here and it's got a divider. I really like being able to separate the cargo area from the cab, although it doesn't have a door. I like being able to access the cargo area from the front. So I might make a modification where I cut this panel and maybe put on some drawer sides here and then just this will be able to slide to the side and then I can access the back without having to get out of the van. But continuing on, we got a bunch of Sortimo shelves and bins here really nice to have and i've got two ladders i've got an extension ladder so i'm in the process of ordering a drop down ladder rack right up there and i have another telescoping ladder that i'm still figuring out what to do with or i might store it here or maybe overhead uh, with a, an interior ladder rack. And I am new to the Ford Transit series. I've had the Ford Econoline. So even though this is a 2015, it's definitely an upgrade for me. I love this feature here where you can lock this in place to keep the doors like this, or you can unlock and push them back here. And then get the magnetic catch there because in my old van I really have to tie down the doors to the roof rack on top because if it was a really windy day the doors would go flying so this is a nice feature and I got this little step up obviously it's seen better days but uh, it works for now and got these cubbies down here and it feels good to be able to stand up, my back is thanking me, um, but I'm really excited. It's got the extended wheelbase, so it's 148 inches long. Um, so if I put a 12 foot board up at a diagonal and rest it up on top of the divider, it fits perfectly. I don't have to put the, the 12 foot boards up on the ladder rack anymore. Definitely an upgrade to the infotainment system. We get Bluetooth, the dash is upgraded, and I just like the layout in here. It's comfortable and uh, sleek. Storage area up here, some paperwork and whatnot. So this is a look into my new van, and uh, I'm excited to see what I come up with for a new tool layout and I will keep you guys updated as I build and store tools in here. Uh, for now, talk to you next time. Take care.